Uh, I know words, I have the best words. <laughs> Hi, I'm Britt from Southwest. Hey, hey Britt. And my poem's called My Anxiety and My Depression Take the Myers Briggs Test. The Myers Briggs Test, scientifically proven to define who you are in just four letters. Isn't it amazing how this 20 plus questionnaire can tell me things that I didn't even know about myself? But my mental illnesses are so intricately intertwined that. It takes me 20 minutes to take a simple test when it took everyone else five. And now I'm stuck staring at my computer screen because I don't know where my mental illnesses end and I start. A breakdown of my chemical imbalances are the first things used to describe me, not who I am. ENFP, extroverted, intuitive, feeling, perceptive. These four words don't describe the 80, 80 page war epic that is going on inside me. But unlike Odysseus, I am no hero. Are you often outgoing to strangers? Well, I constantly crave attention without a state and stream of it. I will literally shrivel up and die. But I have crippling social anxiety causing me to act like an introvert. It feels like I am an animal confined to a cage that is too small, just begging and pleading to escape. Are you a messy person or a tidy person? Well, I have mental breakdowns when rooms are too cluttered, despite my depression telling me no, that I am too tired to pick up my blankets and my shoes and my clothes. And I like to be surrounded with what I am. Garbage. <laughs> Do you often run late to appointments? Well, my anxiety forces me to be at least 15 minutes early while my depression and overall train wreck self have depleted my perception of time. So now I'm just running late with heart palpitations. <laughs> it's like grabbing a bar of soap. I can never just grasp it and it flies away from me at a speed of a million miles an hour. These two personalities are constantly competing to take over me, to flood my mind with their thoughts that there's no room for me. I don't even know what I like. Everything that I have liked is taken away because of depression, and I can't go out and find what I like because anxiety keeps me prisoner in my own home. It feels like I'm on house arrest, but I am my own parole officer. Are you often envious of others? Yes, because most people don't have to take a simple test multiple times. My anxiety and my depression have become two separate entities and I am the weird love child of them both. ENFP, extra neurotic, fantastic person.